Welcome to another Autodesk Revit tutorial. In today's Autodesk Revit tutorial, I will show you how to space these column ties variably. So I still have this L-shaped column right here from the previous video. If you want to learn how to draw in the L-shaped column family and how to draw in the rebar, check out the playlist in the top right. So I'll head back to an elevation view over here and I'll select this set of column ties over here. What you can do is you can edit the bars here and you can select which one that you'd like to delete. But before I space out the ties variably, I'd like to annotate where the quarter point of the column is. So if I I mention it over here, it's 940. And this column is about 3 meters here. So a quarter of the 3 meter column would be about 750 millimeters here. So from the base up to somewhere here, perhaps it's close enough. And I will measure from the top. 860 over here, so it's close enough. So I'll select this set of column ties over here and I will select the edit bars. So in some column tie arrangements, the middle section here would be twice the distance of the ones at the top and bottom. So I'll show you how to do that. So select this set of ties over here, click on edit bars. What you can do is select every other tie over here and you can just delete it like so just by selecting the remove bar option and click on finish and now as you can see at the top and bottom the ties are spaced at 100 millimeters here. Let me just drag these out like so. And in the middle, the ties are spaced at 20 centimeters. So that's how you can space out your column ties variably in Autodesk Revit. And this is how the column would look like in 3D. So as you can see, we've already spaced it out such that the bottom and top would have a spacing of 10 centimeters and the middle section would have a spacing of 20 centimeters. And that's it for today's Autodesk Revit tutorial. If you found it useful, like this tutorial, share this tutorial and subscribe for more Autodesk Revit tutorials like this. Thanks for watching. Goodbye.